bad man. I already know what y'all thinking. Jay, hey, Jay, Jay, this video, you know, this news is two or three days old. Listen, man, I already told y'all we building a data center. I'm having to go and spend very long days, very long nights on this thing, man. So a lot of the news that I'm going to be getting to y'all, it might be a little bit late. We will eventually catch up and we're skipping over a lot of stuff trying to get up, get there and catch up. But listen. This had to be said, man. Yesterday, we dropped a video where we broke down a lot of the runs and a lot of the plays that, they, that the Colorado Buffaloes are working on and, and all that good stuff. And in one of those plays, in full pass, the uh, walk-on, Charlie Offadaw came through with a big run. I didn't want to say his name then because I wanted to give him his own video, all of his own love, all everything. And we're going to look at that in one second and talk about it. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video. Comment y'all thoughts down below, man. Listen. We're just trying to get out here and get our thing done, man. Listen, it's a lot of work. I've been doing a lot of work. I'm sorry I haven't been able to drop the videos like I normally do, like I always do, and like I, you know, like I want to, man. But we're going to get back to it, man. And if nobody told y'all this today, y'all are my family. My brothers, my sisters, I love each and every last one of y'all. Listen, let's just get right into it. So, bow. Here we go. Walk on. Charlie Offerdahl has been one of the standouts of the spring ball so far and it just says hey you keep balling out like this you ain't gonna be a walk on for long man now this is the one that was the twos against the twos we're just gonna go through it real quick and uh yeah we're just gonna break it now let's get it now, this is the play i broke down yesterday it was like a zone run the zone run. come through and he makes a big run it's a zone read zone looks like it was zone left um read the hole got up in there everybody's cheering for him everybody's happy like I said, y'all know how it is. If you ever been to college and you know the walk-on gets in the game or he gets some love or whatever, everybody's showing mad love, but even Dion showing love. Check it out. <laughs> Talk to him, Charlie. Yeah. Why do I work like my work? For my family, for myself. I mean, I want to prove it to everybody. Scouts came to watch another player. And I balled out, and that's why I'm here. Just walk on. Yeah. Hey, you, you keep on balling out, you ain't gonna be a walk on too long. Yeah. 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 Look at everybody going crazy for it. Yeah, Charlie! Big words to be on right now. Stop. Stop. I, I know y'all going to college, y'all done all this stuff, y'all looked at it, and it's just great whenever the walk-on gets in. When I was playing, I was at University of South Carolina, and we had a walk-on, uh, his fellow, fellow name was Jojo Kadri, and, and anytime he got in the game, the crowd erupted. They loved when he got in. We were either get look, basketball team was either getting blasted or we was up high. We was up by a lot. But anytime Jojo got in the game, bro, Everybody went crazy. And the crazy thing about walk-ons is a lot of people don't understand how good these guys actually are. JoJo, everybody would always think, well, you know, he can't be that good because he can't get in the game or whatever. But he would come to open runs and drop 50 on you, and there's nothing you can do about it. Like, your, your skill level is just not on the same skill level with those guys, man. So it's just crazy, like, how much fat. Like, if you put him in a regular race with a regular person, Charlie's going to outrun him, out, outlift him, outwork him. He's going to do all of that, man. And it's just dope that Dion is able to recognize that he comes through and is recognizing him as a walk-on. And he just let him know, hey, listen, man, you keep balling out like this, you're not going to be a walk-on for long. Because, like he said, we don't always get we don't always get it right. Scouts don't always get it right. Sometimes somebody comes in with a chip on their shoulder, they got something to prove, and that's what they're going to do. They're going to walk on, they're going to get it done. And like he said, it's who JoJo coaching now or whatever. He, he got his degree at University of South Carolina. And he's back in Georgia coaching or whatever, man. So, like I said, but anytime he got in the game, touched the floor, it even looked like he was getting in the game. The crowd went crazy. And don't let him score, because he could definitely get buckets. Don't let JoJo, bro, JoJo score. I mean, they, ah, they, they acting like he should be starting and stuff, man. Maybe he should have, man. But listen, anytime you the walk on, you the most loved guy in the university or on that team or whatever. I just love the fact that they're showing him love, man. And, uh, you know, they're welcoming him into the team. And uh, look, look for more to see from him. Maybe he's going to get some get some game time. Hey, maybe not this time. Maybe next year or whatever. Maybe toward the end of the year or just whatever, man. But hopefully he gets, you know, he gets a lot of run. And, uh, you know, he, he gets the opportunity. That's the most important thing. Get the opportunity to show Prime what he got, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I'm going to holler to y'all next time. Till the next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Channel. Guys,